Hello, Pokey fans, and welcome back to another video. I'm excited to share this video because I want to go over something that I'm very excited about because it just gives us one step closer to getting all those single cards from Obsidian Flames. We just sold one of the special illustration rare Charizard EX, and we did not sell it on TCG Player. I'm sorry, guys. I am a Amazon seller. I do eBay, but man, liquidity when it comes to Amazon, you got you to gotta put it in that market. Here it is. I just packed it up for a very, very special customer. I'm hoping you're going to enjoy it as much as I enjoyed pulling this card from Obsidian Flames. This is pretty much the second card I pulled from Obsidian Flames of the Charizard EX. I don't know how lucky I was. That was the first booster box I opened up. For obsidian flames and this just pretty much the profits the the investment out of this card is going back into obsidian flames so don't think i'm just gonna keep it no we gotta use this profit to invest in the other single cards the higher rarity cards from obsidian flames because we're trying to complete the master set so if we can get rid of the doubles and reinvest into the set the better it is one step closer to reaching that master set so anyways i just want to say i was very excited to pull that card and actually sell it uh right away for a higher profit so let's get into the excel sheet uh this is pretty much showing the sales cost minus all the fees material costs and just pretty much showing my profit my overall profit so um pretty self-explanatory make it easy for you guys because that's that's what i gotta do man on the video just make it easier you just sit back relax and just enjoy this video yeah here it is this is the charizard ex a special illustration rare card from a city of flames uh we sold it for 125 dollars and 65 cents that is crazy because if you look at a tcg player uh you will see the chart you will see the market price uh for let's see we go right here it is at 96 dollars and 68 cents it is going down okay guys this card is definitely trending downwards uh it looks like it's uh stabilizing a little bit but it's still too early i'm gonna be honest um but this is a very unique set anyways but it is trending downwards it went down to 96 dollars and uh let's go back a little bit to 68 cents 96.68 um we sold it for 125 dollars and 65 cents and that is the power of amazon um if you try to nothing against ccg player i just i am a am amazon seller and ebay i do e amazon and ebay but i think you gain more profit margins on amazon uh if you guys didn't know tcg player was bought by ebay so again nothing against those platforms i i sell on ebay a lot too as well man that's a increase of like 30 dollars, close to 30 dollars increase in profit if i because i sold it on amazon versus tcg player uh fees are 15 percent if you're a merchant fulfilling it amazon fba which is uh fulfilled by amazon uh it's a little bit different there's shipping costs storage fees uh long-term storage fees there's a lot of the, a lot more uh intense fees to be added but the convenience convenience of amazon doing all the work for you is is an a plus so anyways i've merchant fulfilled because it's small uh the shipping fee was three dollars and 81 cents is first class shipping but now they change it to ground advantage i don't know i'm not gonna go into it it's pretty much the same thing uh just a little twist to it uh we the envelope this is the envelope uh it's about like eight by six i think eight by six nine by six uh that was 30 cents the top loader was about 21 cents card sleeve penny sleeves about 10 cents or penny uh it all depends on where you get it um that's my average cost right now for that specific sleeve yes i do i do uh note down the material cost of each one because that adds up uh is part of business okay guys <laughs> there's no cost of good um for this i i pretty much just minus zero i, I put a zero dollars cost of goods why because that profit of here 102 dollars and 38 cents is going back into obsidian flames we're using the profit out of this 
to gain all the other single cards that we need in order to uh complete the master set we're pretty much getting closer uh that booster box pretty much gain me more of the other cards that i need in the set and this is the other excel file i wanted to show you as you guys can see this is the second uh part of the excel because i just deleted the cards that we just got from that booster box so you can see we knocked out a lot of the common uncommon double rare cards and not too much of the illustration rares and up but i'm telling you um having this card that we just sold right here um the charizard special illustration rare uh that profit is pretty much gonna knock a lot of this out that's why we sold that and that i'm glad we sold it right away it's uh now we can just watch the market once it starts dipping and stabilizing we're gonna start buying these other cards i could tell you the price of these illustration rares just went just decreased I, I was looking at it today and i was like it's still too early <laughs> To be buying single cards you gotta wait you gotta be patient and wait i mean it's really up to you if your pockets are deep everybody's money budget is different okay definitely understandable but uh yeah they did decrease uh every single day so but yeah we have a hundred what was it a hundred two dollars and 38 cents in profit we're gonna pretty much use that money and you can see right here so 188 dollars to 51 that's gonna knock it all the way down to 86 dollars uh that we just need to gain and i don't mind spending another 86 dollars to buy all the illustration rares oh i forgot we still need to spend another 13 so okay so we knocked 102 that's about 86 dollars plus 13 dollars yeah, close to 100 dollars that we need to spend again to buy the rest of the single cars um, to complete the master set. So that's that's awesome. I'm not gonna lie, that is really really good. Um, so it's knocking my list down to a hundred dollars to complete the master set. With that saying, of a hundred dollars, I am not gonna buy another booster box. There's no way. <laughs> There's no point to buy another booster box and think you're gonna complete it. Um, it's better to buy all the rest of the singles and don't gamble it and then you're done, you know? Um, why am I doing it like that? It, because of City of Flames, the pull rates are so much easier in the set that uh, in the market, if you're an investor, in the market of uh, Obsidian Flames, everybody's trying to sell that car, but it's so already, the supply is high. Everybody can have it. So the demand is very low. Uh, people are buying this and pulling everything they can possibly can. So I can tell you this cost right here decreased. The whole master set with all the cards, this is what these columns are. It's a total from August 12th. Um, that was the total price of buying all the singles without buying any booster box, elite trainer box. That's how it was uh the price to buy all the single cards i can tell you this price of 399 uh 55 399 dollars and 55 cents that decreased right now so it's probably at like 350 just to complete a master set i right here is the total how much i invested into pulling all these cards right now currently it was about 249 dollars uh, we just have to reinvest another hundred hundred dollars to complete the master set, which will be a total of three hundred forty nine dollars. I'm hoping you're following what I'm saying, because um, with that hundred two dollars, this knocks it down to eighty six dollars and fifty one cents plus the 13, which is another hundred dollars. So I add that hundred dollars, which eventually once I find the market is stabilized and, and, and the market is very low, then I'll spend that hundred dollars. To buy everything else i'm hoping that makes sense so that will be 349 dollars to complete a master set for myself okay so i'm hoping that sounds correct that's why we're not gonna buy another booster box there's no point of gambling another booster box and thinking we're gonna complete a master set because there's no there's no way <laughs> so anyways that's what i'm doing that's what i did currently i just wanted to say i sold this to a very lucky customer it's very mint i looked at it no whitening centering is a little bit eh but i mean it's i'm hoping they're gonna be happy that they got a special illustration rare 
Charizard EX from your boy, JR. So, anyways, um, let's look at it. Here's the current market. You got the top four Charizards. Of course, everybody's trying to chase those. I was very surprised about the Poppy. This was top 10, but again, the price is decreasing. And I was surprised about this Pidgeot EX card. That's reaching over $10 in value. I can tell you right now, it was about 10 cars that were over $10 in value. Now you can see it's only eight cars over $10 in value. It's decreasing, so please wait. Please wait to buy singles if you can, if you wanna be patient. But if you have the money, your pockets are deep, go ahead and spend it. Uh, yeah, yeah, so we still need to pull the scissor. Uh, scissor 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 car we still need to pull this and the nine tails where's that nine tails right here but again we're going to be using that 102 dollars in profit just to invest in most of these top 10 cards the higher rare cards so we're going to knock it out guys we are definitely going to knock it out but anyways that's what i want to uh let you guys know what's happening right now uh after opening up that booster box the market is still decreasing so definitely wait till you know it's a little bit stabilized in the lower ends and yeah we're not gonna buy another booster box there's no point <laughs> so again uh if you guys enjoyed this video like and subscribe i will see you on the next video because the next video is definitely gonna be a banger um we got two other videos it's the v striker 10 uh walmart versus gamestop which one has the better value we're gonna do that on one video and then we got a lot of crown zenith to open that's gonna be the first time we open crown zenith on this channel i'm hyped i'm very hyped up about that because we got a good value for a booster pack for one booster pack out of it uh so i'm i'm very excited to show you anyways like and subscribe to the channel guys if you enjoyed this i am out of here you guys take it easy peace